Rise and Gregor. It's my name is Tatsumi, and welcome back to some more Balloons TD Battles 2. And as you can see, we are here at Speed Battles because what I want to do in today's video is absolutely speed run through speed battles. You can see here we have zero out of 75 stars right now. And in today's video, I want to go from zero all the way up to 75 and hopefully not lose a single game. Now, I don't know if this is gonna happen, I don't know if we're even gonna be able to get to 75 trophies. But we're going to try and speed run this. So with that being said, let's go ahead and hop into our first game. Oh my god, we actually did it. I, I did not expect, but he actually... Okay, we're doing Bot Factory. There we go. But my strategy for pretty much all of speed battles, I believe, is going to be Dart Alchemist Sub. Um, hopefully this should be good. Dart honestly should be the only tower I even ever need to place down. Because in all honesty, I plan on finishing like almost all of my games if I can by round five if you guys have never played speed battles before or don't know what it is basically all balloon sends are unlocked one round earlier so you're gonna see here i can immediately send blue uh, not blue balloons uh spaced green balloons here and uh also this guy already put his boomerang on the wrong side because that side is the side that's going to actually fall uh first so you know hopefully we can get a quick and easy victory i'm just gonna send him all of these spaced green balloons into spaced yellow balloons into spaced white balloons every spaced balloon i can send i'm going to send him because that should just lead to a really fast and easy victory that being said though he is actually defending pretty well with this the only thing is this side is about to fall right now yeah as you can see it's about to fall so he's really only gonna have this boomerang monkey now he's gonna effectively his popping power is gonna be cut in half from this all right i'm gonna go ahead and upgrade to even faster firing here uh, I'm going to balloon boost these when whites come out next round, which should be any second now. Uh, actually, he might just die to this anyway, but like for sure he's gonna die when uh, when these pink start. Pink, I said white when pink balloons come in. Yeah, he, he's about to die right here. That second boomerang is not gonna help you. Not when I boosted these spaced pink balloons at you, and uh, that should be game. There we go. Zero lives. Easy. Send him a good game, and as you can see here, this is going to be our first four star victory, not five stars. Oh, no, we didn't get the first blood either. Okay, three-star victory. I forgot. Basically, to get these last two stars, you need to have this icon, which is the first blood icon. So you need to get the first leak on your opponent. And this icon, which is when you don't lose any lives on your side. Which, I'm probably almost never going to get this because I'm not going to focus on saving lives. I'm going to focus on just killing them fast. But you know what? Three stars are three stars. We're on the leaderboard. Oh, damn. I got a one times from a from just a regular chest? I didn't even know they had those in them. Okay, that's pretty cool, I guess. Okay, second game here. Now, I don't know if I should continue going with the attack shooter as my first tower, or if I should go pat. Because I can go pat. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm, I'm gonna put pat down. Um, I don't know if this is even gonna benefit me at all. Is this the same guy? This might be the same. I feel like it could be the same guy. I mean, he's doing the same exact strat, so like... He's, he's also already boosting this, which is a great sign for me. Um... I mean, if this is the same guy, hopefully we can get yet another good victory off him. Um, but like I was saying, I don't know if it's even worth it to put down Pat. Because again, I planned on ending these matches as fast as humanly possible. So, <laughs> Pat just might not be worth it in exchange for going with a blade shooter, you know? But I guess we'll just have to see about that. Also, I don't really want to leak lives because I want to... Okay, great. Thanks, Tag Shooter, so much. You are you're such a helpful tower. I leaked one life. Okay, since this guy got the uh, the Glaive Ricochet, I'm just going to send a few uh, a few of these group balloons before I send in these uh, sorry white balloons. I just cannot get my colors right today. But I think that white balloons would pose a little bit of a problem for him. It looks like probably not anymore just because he's gotten three boomerangs now. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and go back to sending uh, grouped ecos just so I can actually get my regular eco up. Because if this guy's not going to die, there's really no use in sending him spaced balloons. Oh, he's selling his... Is he going to get a, a um, glaive... What's it called? More glaives, maybe? He's just not going to... I mean, if he's just going to sell those for nothing, then I'm going to send him more stuff again. Like, I don't know... It looks like he has a uh, longer range, probably, but... Oh, no, that's faster throwing. Okay, and he did go for the uh, the more glaives. That, that was weird. But, you know what? Honestly, one good rush, and this guy is dead. So, I'm thinking... You know, probably a zebra rush would uh, hit the, the pierce uh, max on this guy. Or possibly, if we want to wait, we can go into Ceramic Balloons, and uh, this guy would definitely die to Ceramic Balloons. Alright, oh yeah, actually, no, this guy just doesn't have any lead popping power. I forgot, he went he went faster firing on these, so 
Yeah, no, that that wizard is down way too late, and also the wrong cross path. So, uh, so GG's to this guy. That's <laughs> that's unfortunate. He went with the wrong cross path. I, I think anyway, though, it would have been too late. He put it, he put the tower down too late for it to actually pop enough balloons. But that is unfortunate. That's crazy. My man randomed into this map. I accepted it, and he left. Okay, so we got the map Koru here. This is a super, super short map, so I am not even going to bother sending, um, er, not sending, I'm not even going to bother putting Pat down. Also, it is, is it a little bit laggy? I think it's actually fine right now. Uh, but okay, this guy's going to do the same strat against me, which means we're both going to leak a little bit, uh, but I will have my Blade Shooter up in this next income boost here. So, yep, now that I got this, I should be fine against these green balloons. Uh, but he's going to end up leaking a ton more than me because he put Pat down, and actually, if I boost these, I think I should just win on round one. Oh, round, round two, come on. Oh, that was like a second away from being a round one victory. Okay, but you know what? You know what? I'm not going to complain about that. I will absolutely take it. All right, so we're on Garden. This map might be a little bit tricky for me, in all honesty. Uh, I think what I want to do is I think I actually do want to get Pat down first. And I'll set this guy to close. Um, yeah, he, I don't know why he only sent me like a little spurt of red balloons there. Um, we are going to leak some lives to it. I, I don't even care. This guy's going Druid, though. Uh, he will leak a ton of lives here, but I don't think he'll end up dying to this. But I think once we can send maybe pink balloons, but most likely white balloons, then he will actually probably end up dying. You know what? He is still leaking some. I think pink balloons... Oh, no, this is actually just going to do it. <laughs> okay, sick. Another easy round two victory. The One Piece! <laughs> I knew it! I knew it! Every time I ran him into inflection, people just leave! I don't- why? Okay, so we got a pretty long map here, so I don't know if this is necessarily going to be a round two victory like we've been having. You know what? Um, I think it might be, actually. Never mind. I'm gonna boost these the second I can. Um, I, I think this might actually be a round two victory. Hold on. Boost these immediately. Also, hold off. Send some send some yellows in a second here. Where are the yellows? Come on. There we go. Send these yellows and, uh, yep, this guy. Okay, cool. Hey, for the first time, we got all five stars, too. Hell yeah. All right, one of my favorite maps in the game. And, uh, if you guys don't know... You can put your tax shooter in this spot right here. If you try and get it as much as in the middle as you can. I, that sentence was just wrong. Uh, but you can go ahead and do a blade shooter in this spot. And uh, it's actually insane. Also, there was a lot of lag when I upgraded that. But you know what? It's fine because this guy's first tower was open. So I think regardless, we're going to win. Wow, the lag. My man put down the lag, Dartling Gunner. What was that? <laughs> Even my balloon sends are laggy. Oh my god. But uh, I want to balloon boost these yellows at him because his dartling gunner's not in a great position right now and uh this should just take him down the last 19 lives we need to win oh so close and uh yep there we go that should do it it's really laggy but there we go we did get the victory all right so this guy's hero was snowman ben which Okay, I, I was going to say, that makes me wonder if this guy's going to run the meta strategy, which is Snowman Ben, Dartling Ice. But, nope, he is running the uh, the actual good strategy for this, which is going to be Tag Shooter. Also, I missed my getting of the Blade Shooter, so I'm going to take a little bit more lives with that. But um, this guy's also doing Blade Shooter, so I'm actually just going to fully switch into Group Balloons, because it's pretty much just because he's running Blade Shooter, you know, nothing's going to get past it, so I'm just going to Eco. Alright, get my pet down with one more income boost, which hopefully should be before the start of round four here. Uh, yep, there we Oh my god, I think I got it- I got it right after round four. That is- Oh, that's embarrassing. But I'm gonna put him on close. And then I think we should be good to defend spaced whites if he sends them. Let's see if he can. I'm actually gonna go ahead and boost these, because I think these might do a little bit of damage. He is going ice, okay. That is unfortunate, but ice can't pop white balloons- Looks like he's going to get another attack shooter. Okay, with that, he honestly should be fine. Black balloons might cause a bit of a problem for him. Uh, you know what? Not with double blade shooter. I'm going to go back to sending uh, my group deco. Let's see. He's going to have a little bit of a hard time against lead balloons. So next round, I'm going to send him some lead balloons. I'm going to boost them. And this might be able enough to get through. 
Oh wow, actually, Snowman Pat is just didn't it's just deleting those. So <laughs> never mind. Uh, but maybe if I send him a big purple rush, that could actually get him. Uh, purple zebra rush, I'm thinking. Let's go ahead and send him just a ton of zebras and stuff. I think this might be able to get through in time. Come on. No! Oh my, that, oh, that was so close. That was so close. Good game to this guy. What, he sh bro, I almost destroyed you. I should have sent him purples. Purples were just, would have been a little bit faster, but, uh, if I just, oh, it's, it's, it's sad. Yeah, okay. Well, I am a little bit upset about that last game, but you know what? You can't break an egg without making a few omelets, am I right, gamers? Uh, <laughs> uh, and also, you know, now I know that instead of doing, like, grouped zebra rushes, it might be better to, uh, just do grouped purple rushes. That might just be a little bit better for me. So, I guess I got, you know, I got that going for me at the very least. Also, I did get first blood, which is nice. And, uh, hopefully we can get another quick and easy victory. This guy's already boosting, so I think after this boost wears off, I'll send him spaced yellow balloons, and then that might do enough to kill him. Hopefully, I guess we'll have to see. I'll probably balloon boost these. Uh, oh, he did get wall of fire up to him. I didn't even didn't even notice that. Okay, so he's pretty much fine against spaced balloons. So instead of doing anything like that, I am simply going to go ahead and upgrade to faster shooting, get my pat down, and then we can pretty much just play this like a normal game for the most part. Okay, I can see if white balloons will do anything to him. Uh, it might at the very least force him to get a dartling upgrade. Uh, but, oh, you know what? Honestly, Wall of Fire is just still shredding. I did force an upgrade, though, so you know what? I will absolutely take that. And, uh, we should be good against Whites on our side, because faster, even faster shooting with this tag shooter spot just, like, cleans up completely. Through Space Blacks, actually, honestly, through just up until, like, round 11, this spot just absolutely shreds. It's so good. Okay, I think at this point, I'm going to start sending some purples. Not because I think they're going to do anything to him. Just because I want to save up a bit of money, I want to go for my overdrive on this tag shooter, and I think then I'll elk buff it. And I think at that point we should be fine against most round, well I guess it'd be round 10 rushes. Uh, we should be fine hopefully, so I'm also going to go ahead and do, do I have to boost this? I'm going to pat ability this. Uh, and then I will also go ahead and get my overdrive now when I can, don't know why he's boosting that. Uh, there we go, also put this guy on last for now. And we should be good now. With this overdrive, and eventually with him having, uh, the, the acidic, the, I said acidic mixture day, the berserker brew, uh, we should be fine. I also go stronger acid, yeah, stronger acid perishing potions, and I think with this we should be fine. If we need to desperately, we sell this guy and panic buy Maelstrom up here, but I think we should be fine with this. I think this should honestly even cover spaced rainbows, hopefully, I guess let's see. Uh, this guy's probably gonna send me space for him, most if I had to guess. Is he not, for real? Okay, well, I guess he's not. That's, uh, fine by me. Uh, in that case, what I'm going to do is I'm going to build another dart, or tag shooter, I guess. Oh, right, camo. Yeah, no, um, I'm just not gonna get- I- yep, forgot that I have a third tower, and that's my- okay, two losses in a row, you know what? Um, it's, it's fine. <laughs> oh, damn, that was bad. Uh- you know what, we, we gotta make a comeback next game. That's all we need to do. Ooh, okay, so this guy's doing a ninja start. Um, I think that's gonna actually get overwhelmed pretty easily, especially with, like, yellows and pink balloons. So, I think once we can balloon boost... I'm gonna balloon boost yellows at him, and honestly, he should die. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's, that's gonna be the goal. Yeah, after... Okay, after his balloon boost wears off, I'm gonna boost these yellows at him, and he is gonna die for sure. So, let's get ready. He did get double shot. I don't know if that's gonna quite do it for him i guess we'll see uh he's kind of struggling i guess i'll boost them anyway it'll definitely make him lose a few lives at the very least okay yeah now that pink balloons are coming up i didn't even realize wow he lost a lot of lives to that actually that's kind of insane uh i guess i'll just keep sending pink balloons and then you know what white balloons will for sure kill him if he doesn't get anything else down so maybe i'll wait for white balloons here i don't what is he balloon boosting at me he sent, like, four spaced pinks. That was... <laughs> okay. Uh, Gren... Is, is that gonna do enough? I'm gonna boost these. I think he's still gonna die. I think he will get overwhelmed with this. Yeah. It looks like he will for sure. Uh, with the boost, he probably won't. Unfortunately. Okay. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. We're still in a way better position. Go even faster shooting here. I'm not sure if this will do anything. But let's try some regrow, uh, camos. Not Rigo camos, Rigo uh, zebra balloons. 
This might do something. I'll go ahead and boost this at him. You know what? I think these are going to end up sneaking through. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, let's go. Okay. Woo, damn. That was, uh... That was a pretty good game, honestly. I did not expect that ninja to defend as much as it did, but you know what, GG's. Alright, here we go, and as you can see, we finally get to play on Inflection. Uh, so I think the best spot for my tag shooter is probably gonna be down here. Um, I think so. Also, wow, I just defaulted to sending him, uh, red balloons by accident, but I definitely want to send this guy, uh, green balloons. At... Looks like he actually will end up defending because, again, he does have the tag shooter. Okay, so it looks like white balloons are actually causing some problems. So I'm gonna go ahead and balloon boost these. Oh, he did get a second blade shooter. Okay. Okay, you know what? Fair enough. He is really hurt, though, I will say. So I'm gonna go ahead and get myself, I guess, a berserker. You know what? I'm gonna send him... Oh, damn. I was trying to go no lives lost, but looks like him sending white balloons will make me lose just a little bit of lives. But honestly, uh, it should be fine. I guess I'll go with uh, another... Oh, okay. He died. Never mind. I... <laughs> I wasn't even paying attention, but yeah, there we go. Okay, sick. All right, this map is going to be a little bit hard for probably both of us here. Um, okay, he's going Druid. Okay, that's honestly a bit weird because, like, it is really easy to leak over the amount of lives that you want in speed battles. He's going to end up getting another Druid down there. Okay. You know, I think I'm going to chill just a little bit, but when Yellow Balloons come, I Balloon Boost them. Or not, he's just going to surrender. Fair enough, GG. <laughs> And with that five-star victory from our opponent surrendering, that puts us a little more than halfway done with the event. So there we go. Okay, for these next few battles, I'm going to really try and actually speedrun because the video might be getting a little bit too long at this point. So uh, let's go ahead and just show some wins. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> that was the longest game I've had yet. I just could not rush that guy for the life of me. Did, did the reinforced Moab kill him? Like, I couldn't even see. I think I was probably dead to those Moabs he sent me. Wow. Wow. Amazing game. Oh my god. Ooh, okay, there we go. That game again went on for like a long time. That went way longer than these games normally last. But again, GG's to this guy. That was a very good game. Oh, let's go. Okay. When I saw him put down that farm, I was like, yeah, I'm going to balloon boost these whites because I didn't think he was going to get the faster barrel spin in time on his dartling. Oh my God. Let's go. Another really close game though. Honestly, like if he just got the, uh, the faster barrel spin like a little bit earlier, then he would have been fine. And we would have taken the game again, a lot later than normal. Okay. So first time playing on basalt columns, uh, for this video for most of speed battles, actually, I don't really, I don't play speed battles all too often, actually. Uh, and I don't think I've really ever played speed battles on Basalt Columns specifically. Uh, so I guess we're just gonna have to see how it goes. But it already looks like we're doing pretty well. So I think, again, we're gonna balloon boost these at him. And then when yellows come, uh, it honestly, he should- Okay, never mind, just he died. Round one victory. Sick. <laughs> Huge two times multiplier on this. Look at all the stuff I got. Okay. 
Okay, that was strange. Uh, you don't need to destroy that rock in order to put the tag shooter up there. Um, but whatever works, I guess. Also, that's the wrong cross path to go for originally. Uh, so I am for sure gonna balloon boost yellows at him. Uh, I know that I can balloon boost greens, but I feel like yellows... Also, yeah, because he boosted now. Uh, it's better to wait, but... Yellows, I think... I mean, yellows are faster, so they'll probably pose more of a problem. So I'll go ahead and balloon boost them now. This boost is about to wear off. Uh, and honestly, this should be good. I'll go ahead and upgrade my guy a little bit. Also, I don't really want to leak. Um, I think I will, though. Oh, dang, I did leak. Okay, I leaked, what, five lives? You know what? Honestly, that's fine. Uh, this guy should probably be dead soon. I think Pink's honestly will probably kill him. Even with two tax sprayers, I think he's probably still dead. All right, here we go. I'm balloon boost some whites at him, and whites will finish him off just 100%. Like, there's, there is no shot he defends spaced whites. Like, no, I'm sorry. You just can't. And there we go, gamers. Just like that, we have 61 out of 75 trophies. We only have one more tier left to go. We only need, what, 14 more stars? And then we got this. So that's probably going to be, like, maybe three or four more games. So let's just hop right into it and, you know, continue the speed run. Aw, oh, damn. You know what? I actually kind of feel bad for this guy. Judging from his Wi-Fi signal up here, he's almost definitely on mobile. So th this is probably going to be, like, another round one, round two victory. I'm, I'm sorry about it, dude. You know what? This strategy is actually working a lot better than I thought it would. Uh, I think he is probably dead here. I think he's going to leak just a, like just a little bit too much. Yeah, it looks like he did. But you know what? All credit to this guy. I did not think the Quincy Dartling would do that good. Alright, another map that I haven't played on before in, in speed battles. Actually, you know what? To be fair, I think I've only played on this map maybe like two times since it came out. Actually, also Glue Gunner. Okay, um, I'm just gonna balloon boost these these greens then, and uh, he's, yeah, no, he's dead. Uh, sorry, sorry about it, but glue, glue is, um, yeah, no, just just no. Let's go! We got the round one victory! Hell yeah! <laughs> Let's go! Okay. And with that round one victory, as you can see, we only need two more stars to beat all of speed battles with the speed run. So I think technically, do we even need to win the next battle? I think we get like one star regardless, right? You get like one star for playing. You can get a star for... You can get a star for No Lives Lost, and you get a star for, um, what is it? First Blood. So, like, if we just get First Blood, we don't even need to win. I mean, I'm gonna win regardless, but, like, yeah, we don't even technically need to win this game. You know what? I'm game if this guy is. Ports is just a terrible map. I hate the map Ports, especially for speed battles. I feel like it's gonna be terrible. But you know what? If, if we can get our final win on Ports, then I'll be happy. Okay, so I kind of want to put my tag shooter up here. Um, I'm going to do that. I'm going to go ahead and remove this. I'm putting my tag shooter right here. Uh, it, it's not the best strategy. No, for sure it's not. But this should get me first blood at the very least. So now, no matter what, I win. Like, no matter what I do now, I, I beat the challenge. I, I, I'm playing this game right now. I got first blood. So, like, I won. Also, after his boost wears off right here, I am going to balloon boost these yellows at him, and I think he should be dead. Let's see, I don't think... Wow, you know what? Double shot on this on this uh, submarine. Honestly, it's doing pretty good. Where's the thumbs up? There it is. I'll say good game to this guy, and there we go, gamers. We have officially completed speed battles with the speed run. Now, I don't actually know how fast I did this. Uh, I think in real life, it took about maybe like an hour hour and a half just because i also had to stop recording like halfway through but i mean hell there we go but hopefully in the video it's like 20 minutes or less hopefully if i can you know edit it down to be somewhere in that range that would be great 
Uh, but, you know, if you guys enjoyed it, please like the video. Like the video if you like it. Subscribe if you really liked it. Thanks for watching. Let me go ahead and collect my winnings here from this beautiful mystical gold chest. Looks, it looks, oh, mwah, just chef's kiss. Uh, really not looking for anything specific. I just kind of want the money. And uh, we'll probably get, oh, wow, you know what? We didn't even get a boost. I mean, honestly, I'm kind of happy because if I got a boost, then I would need to play more. And I kind of want to go play different games right now. But, like... I'm kind of surprised because usually with the uh, the mighty chest here, you like always get a like one times or even like a two times boost or something, which it's also kind of funny because I got a boost from this chest and I got a boost from this chest, but not from from this chest. But you know what? It doesn't it doesn't matter. That's fine. Uh, I'm going to end the video there. So again, if you liked it, please like it. If you liked it, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Hopefully the video wasn't too long. And with all that, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.